again, don't forget to use the peak and lean. It's an invaluable tool. Um, and it's something that, again, you know, most games, most FPS games, you know, these days, especially on console, don't have. They don't have that peak and lean functionality. Um, but we're going to check it out and see if we can uh, shred some heads here. So I'm paired up with this guy, your worst enemy. I have no idea who he is. But I'm going to go with my uh, US OGA to Assaulter. I like this class. Um, and let's go. And here I'll show you the, the peak and lean. See? You can kind of move around. If I go over here and I'm ducking, instead of having to come all the way out of cover, I can just kind of peek around it and, you know, get a couple quick shots off. Um, it seems that we are the... Are we the attackers? Not sure here. Are we the defenders? Nope, we're the defenders here. Now, this guy's coming up the track. And we took those two guys out pretty single-handedly. Chuck a grenade over there. And maybe we'll find some other guys around here, get a couple quick kills. Um, but we need to defend that point. Which is all the way back here by the back bus. So they may be uh, trying to plant. If they're smart, they'll be trying to plant. Oh, and I just got shredded. Uh, that guy spawned behind me. Oh, he's right there, right behind me. Just tore my backside up. But I'm going to spawn on my buddy. That's another thing about this game that's really nice. Is the fact that you can spawn. Uh, you know, It's like little mobile spawn points. So you can uh, kind of hop in on your battle buddy here. Kind of support him. So let's go. So we just defused the charge there, which was nice. Oh, they're throwing grenades. That guy's right there. You can see he's lit up. Somebody's got him uh, on lock. All right, so they planted. They're right there. Let's see if we can get that guy. Got him. Not today, pal. All right, let's see if we can defuse this bomb, huh? Hopefully, my uh, my buddy there will uh, will cover me. Oh, where's the bomb at? Uh, oh. I'm at the wrong <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I just realized I was at the wrong, the wrong site. So let's get down in this, uh, in this gully here. Let's see if we can, uh, see if we can defuse this bomb. All right. Oh. Ah, oh, that guy was corner camping the wall. Had no grenades. Couldn't do nothing about that. All right. So it looks like they got the first bomb site. Uh, this game, hot spot. It's the first one to destroy three bomb sites. Uh, so they've got one. If they destroy another two, then uh, they'll win the game. Uh, there's a total of five bomb sites. Uh, oh, you got wrecked, son. Um, total of five bomb sites. Uh, the defending team knows which one is going to become the one that they that the assaulting team has to basically uh, destroy. While if you're on the assaulting team, um, you know it just kind of randomly chooses which one, and then you gotta hope you're in the right spot at the right time uh, in order to get it. Look at these guys. Oh, there's a guided missile coming down. You can see it down there on mini-map, the big red missile there. Hopefully it doesn't hit me, because that wouldn't be cool. So again, we just have to defend this point here. Um, you can see those guys are being spotted out. Little red dots. Red's always bad. Um, hopefully they'll come this way and I'll get some good shots. Now you can also change your rate of fire on some weapons and that's just down on the d-pad. And you can see down by my ammo count, right now it has that, uh, that single round next to the 31 rounds. If you press down, automatic versus uh, semi-automatic. So single shot uh, fire every time I hit the uh, uh, trigger button. Uh, you can also resupply your teammates if you run up behind them and Oh, there may be a guy coming here. So I killed him. Alright, so I've got a support action. I'm going to get sniped. Uh, I'm going to try dropping mortars because that's my first support action group. Uh, my level 1 support action is mortars and a smoke screen. So what I'm going to try to do here... Oh, somebody else called in mortars in there. Then I'm going to call in some mortars. Uh, you know what? I think I might actually save it. Nope, I'm going to call it in right there. And hopefully we'll def 
diffuse that. I'm going to slip around here to the right, and it looks like we got a good diffuse. So I've got buddies who are doing a little bit of work, which is always nice. Uh, and I'm going to go around to the right. I'm going to try to flank and get behind them. Um, as it is in the beta right now, it you can spawn camp the enemy. It's uh, fairly easy to lock them back here by the stadium. Hopefully that gets fixed in the uh, final build. Um, and it looks like somebody's got a chopper up because they're just doing work. But hopefully the spawns get uh, ironed out. Um, you know, maybe it's just this map. I don't know. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell with only, you know, playing one map here. So we're going to kind of hide behind this truck here. See? A little peek and lean. Pop out, shoot somebody in the face. So I'm not sure where these guys are coming from. All right, you got a guy over there. We're going to roll up the backside here. And it looks like this guy's right here. Throw a grenade. Oh, that guy's got my number. Uh, he had a buddy down low, too. Didn't see that guy, but no big deal. Hopefully, we should be able to defend this point. Um, again, I'm going to spawn on my buddy. And every time you spawn on uh, a friend, there we go, resupply him. Give him some ammo, some health. Uh, throw a grenade in there. Oh, we got somebody with a nade. I don't think he was expecting that. Oh, not sure where that guy got hit from. There he is. Ooh, that guy is angry. Where'd he go? Oh, that's a friend. There's another guy. Drop that dude. And it looks like they got a chopper coming. Alright, we got a guided missile though. Oh, that's okay. I'm going to use a guided missile on their chopper, you guys. Check this out. This will be cool as hell. <clears throat> so, my buddy's dead, so I actually have to do the fallback spawn. Which again, no big deal. Alright, so we're going to laze that out there. And I'm going to hit that Blackhawk with this... Uh, with this missile. So that blackout kind of acts as a mobile spawn point, but it also goes away. Oh, it didn't get destroyed. Well, I know you can destroy the Blackhawk with the mortars, and that's weird that that didn't go down. Uh, oh, yeah, there you go. Force vehicle retreat. The grenade out there. Oh. Shot in the back. Well, that's interesting. I really thought that that missile would be able to take that chopper out. Again, I've seen it with the, uh, and I've done it with the, uh... Oh, give me just a second here. I've done it with the mortars, so... Not quite sure why that didn't work. Oh, didn't see the guy on the left. But, got the guy in front of me. What are we at here? We're at 15 and 7, so we're doing work. Uh, let's go buddy spawn. And we actually may lose this game. Yeah, we just lost that point, so hopefully... Uh, that guy was unsuspecting. We're going to have to do something about that chopper. Let's see here. Oh! Tomahawked. I should have just meleeed him. I'm not used to this control scheme. I'm used to playing Call of Duty where I got my melee on the B button. Uh, the default is... Uh, I'm not sure. I think the default is... Yeah, that's what it is. Right, we'll resupply our buddy. Uh, wow. Mince me. What I do like about this game, I like the fact that uh, it doesn't take a lot of shots to kill people. Um, I know you guys played it in Call of Duty. You know, sometimes it does take a, an extraordinarily large amount of bullets to down somebody. But uh, this doesn't seem to be the case, which is nice. So. Alright, that guy's out. Oh, they just called in an A-10, tried to do a strafe run on us. That didn't work out too well for them. I'm not sure if they got any kills for that. Alright, so it looks like we got a Blackhawk coming in, which is nice. This guy's throwing grenades at me for some reason. He's on my team. 
not quite sure what that was all about, but, you know, whatever. Alright, we're going to try to get out here. Hopefully those mortars will put those guys down. Throw a grenade over there. Oh! Guys snuck in behind us. So let's change up the class here. I'll show you guys uh, support class and a neat thing you can do with the support class. Uh, so if we go to change class, uh, let's go with the British SAS Heavy Gunner. I don't want to spawn in a Black Hawk, but it looks like it's going to spawn me there anyway. Oh, I don't like spawning in the Black Hawk. I, I think it's weird, the points that it puts you at. Um, oops. It's kind of janky. Let's just go fall back here. Alright, we're going to get jiggy with the uh, support guy here. Um, we've got a guy coming around. <sighs> Could do anything about that. Those quick guys, they're dirty. Uh, was it the point man and the, uh, the scout, I guess? Not the sniper, but the guy on the far right. Can't remember what he's called, but they're really quick, and their weapons do a lot of damage. But, uh, that same damn guy. <laughs> hopefully they kill him. Alright. So hopefully I'll spawn on my buddy here in two seconds. It looks like my buddy's a support class too. I'm gonna keep resupplying him, heal him. Uh, let's see if we put this chopper down. And again, peeking, peeking. If that guy pops up on that gunner slot, he's going downtown. All right, so support action. Heavy machine gunner, you can deploy your bipod and get shot in the face. Drop a grenade out there. <laughs> I didn't see that guy down there on the left, but that's all right. How are we doing? Are we still leading the pack? All right, spawn on the buddy again. Resupply buddy. All right, so we need to defuse that bomb. So I'm gonna go for the defuse. As I'm getting shot. Alright. Alright, I'm going to put a smoke screen down here. Need to reload here. Alright, looks like we defuse it. Good to go. Alright, right. chop that dude up. And let's deploy this Mark 19. And let's put this thing right here. Check this bad boy out. So we're just going to wait for them to, uh, to get in here and die. Thing is awesome. All right. So let's see here. Oh. See, that's that peak and lean. Got him. All right. Points changed. We actually successfully defended that one, so now we got to go to the next one. I'm actually going to go the back route while I'm reloading here. I'm going to get down here. We get the pipe bipod set up, and uh, hopefully they'll come through this little area and we'll chew them up. Actually, let's 
get a little further down here. Alright. Oh, guy got behind us. Could do nothing about that. Picked one guy off. I, I didn't think they'd be able to get around because we had a lot of guys back there, but it is what it is. Waiting to spawn. <laughs> Looks like the whole team's coming out the Blackhawk. Alright. So we're going to try to sneak around back here. Alright, so that guy's set up there. I'm going to set up here. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I knew that was going to be a bad idea. Oh. Yeah, no kidding. There he is. Oh, that guy was up there in the bobsled track shooting through the hole. Tried to get him, put a little fire on him. Hopefully he'll think twice about coming out of there. I'm going to spawn on my buddy. Ah, oh, he got me again. Sniper in there. So let's change class again. Uh, doesn't look like that the uh, heavy guy is working out for me. Let's go with uh, point man. Sure. We'll roll. Ah, you know what? Let's go with the demolitions guy. This looks like fun, huh? This guy's got super armor. Um, his kill streaks are kind of cool. He gets his crazy grenade launcher. And we can use ballistic armor. So what the ballistic armor is, it's just kind of like a uh, heavy armor. He's almost like the juggernaut um, in Call of Duty. Got him. Got him. So we cleared those guys out of there pretty quickly there. Got a guy coming. All right, check this out. <laughs> so you get this crazy grenade launcher with six rounds. And let's see where are they coming. Where are they coming from? All right, we got a guy coming right there. <laughs> Tell you, this grenade launcher is nutty. Got another guy coming. Right now, that guy doesn't know what's going on. He's dead. There's another one coming. Oh, looks like they got a chopper coming up. Oh, damn it. Didn't realize I had no bullets. But that's alright. We got some good kills on that. We got some good kill streaks. So let's spawn on our buddy here, if we can. And every time your buddy's in danger, whether he's spotted or whatever, you'll see uh, the timer reset up there. And that's just because uh, it's dangerous. All right. Oh, Apache got me. That's all right, though. So I think I've got something in store for that Apache. All right. Let's resupply our friend there. All right, so I've got a rocket launcher, um, which is a small. You can see my support actions up there. It's small or fire team replenish. What fire team replenish does, just as it says, it uh, gives and refills ammo and everything for your for your fire team. And this heavy class actually moves uh, fairly quickly uh, for being heavy. It only slows down when. Uh... Oop! Didn't want that. Let's get down here. I'm gonna get down here and disarm this uh this bomb. And I'm gonna put my armor on. And it looks like they jammed our radar. We'll save our buddy there. That was a good good save. All right, we disarmed the bomb. Nice. This guy up there, 
And you can see our, our mini map is jammed up right now. Alright. Some guys coming here. To the right. One just went in that building. They've got snipers up there. But I don't think they're going to get anywhere near this bomb here. And it looks like they've got a, uh, a Raven up as well. Or a UAV, rather. But it looks like we've got a chopper, so it doesn't really matter. So chopper beats Raven any day of the week. We've got a guy coming here. He doesn't realize that I've got crazy armor. And now he is dead. There's another guy coming. Alright, check this out. Let's use this rocket on him, huh? <laughs> got a hit on him. Gotcha. Got that guy. I think we got that guy. Oh, they got me with a grenade. If I had more heavy armor, I wouldn't have been able to get killed by the grenade. But, you know, I think I did well. Um, so let's change up the class one more time. Let's go with... Uh, Ah, sure, why not? We'll go with point man here. Spawn on the buddy. Oh, we just got demolished by a mortar. So I hope you guys, you know, give the beta a try. Um, it's, you know, the beta is available to all Xbox Live Gold members right now. You can download it on, uh, from the marketplace, um, free of charge. Keep in mind, it is a beta, and because it's a beta, you know, there are some, uh, you know, rough edges. Uh, but that's to be expected. So hopefully the, the final game will... Oh, they got the plan. Hopefully the final game will be uh, a little bit more polished. Um, I think there's a guy up there. Throw a grenade up there. Oh, stuck on a wall. We just got shot in the back. Demolished. Um, keep in mind, it is a beta. Uh, you know, Danger Close is still a relatively new uh, developer. This is really their first multiplayer game that they've designed, or multiplayer aspect of a game. Um, so I kind of give them, cut them a little slack. You know, Call of Duty, Treyarch, and Infinity Ward. You know, they've been, you know, making multiplayer games for a while now. So, so of course, there's a little bit more refined. If you guys remember the first Call of Duty, um, uh, and it looks like they won. If you remember the first Call of Duty, you know, it was a little bit rough. But uh, I think given time, there's a good foundation. There's a nice base here uh, to work with. Uh, and, you know, Medal of Honor can become a really, really good multiplayer game in the next couple of iterations. So I hope you guys, you know, learned something uh, from this video. I know it was a little bit long, but uh, a lot of information in the beginning. And uh, let me know how your games turn out. I'll be putting up more videos, especially when this comes out at the end of this month. Uh, really looking forward to it. Um, let's see here. Next, how do we do? Scoreboard 35-23. Um, yeah, not bad. Loads of points. Uh, and we were the number one fire team. At least for our team, we were. Uh, if we had won, we would have been the number one fire team overall. But but again, I'm going to be putting up a lot of Medal of Honor Warfighter videos, and I hope you guys watch. I'll be putting up more videos in general. Uh, now that my son's a little bit older, um, I'm finding a little bit more time to uh, to make videos and. and get some recordings and get these uh, videos out to you guys on YouTube. So stay tuned, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.